Good evening, Rio Grande Valley. Tonight, we learn about one woman's experience with an intracerebral hemorrhage and how endovascular surgery changed her life. Maricela Perez is one of many Americans that suffer from an intracerebral hemorrhage, an extremely common form of stroke where a blood vessel ruptures in the brain, causing bleeding. The treatment options we offer is an endovascular approach. So basically we take these little tubes and go in through the groin and up into the blood vessels that supply the brain. And we go in and we navigate our wires and our catheters through the small vessels until we get to the vessel of interest. And then basically we use medical grade glue and shut down those feeders. Dr. Hassan explains traditional treatment for such a condition would remove the affected portion of the brain, but doing this would have left Perez without any motor function on her right side and without the ability to speak. The major causes for intracerebral hemorrhage is something we call an AVM or an arterial venous malformation, which is basically a clumping of abnormal blood vessels between the arteries and the veins. The Valley Baptist Medical Center in Harlingen is the only facility south of San Antonio able to offer this latest technology. I've been able to achieve the best possible outcome with the brain. Reporting on Health Matters, I'm Lissa Hansen.